so. How do you feel about this episode? Mm-hmm. Do you feel good about this episode? I feel pretty good about this episode. I have to fart. Do you? Yeah. I mean, let it go. Whatever makes you comfortable, man. I didn't really fart. Oh, okay. I was just kidding. <laughs> I was miming it for you guys at home. So you, you were all expecting to fart. You didn't get it. He actually pooped his pants. It I did. Awful. I shot <laughs> it. It's bad. But you know what isn't bad? What's that, Randy? This show, Whatnots. No, it's We're not. We're the hosts. I'm Todd. I'm Randy. Today on Whatnots, Whatnots, of course, is a show mm-hmm. about, about things, about stuff and things, mm-hmm. stuff we buy. Mm-hmm. Every once in a while, we'll do unboxings. Uh, we're going to get some subscription services. You'll be able to, to watch us uh, comically open boxes. Uh, and today is one of those. It's not a subscription service, but we have we have two blind boxes, and we also have a frozen treat. Ooh. Uh, so what are the blind boxes? Well, I think I want to do the frozen treat first. Okay. Right. Because, uh, you know, I, I just think it was, is necessary. So yeah, sure. I'm going to have my, my lovely off-camera assistant is going to be bringing us frozen Han Solo and Carbonite ice cube trays i'm sure you've seen these if you are a star wars fan you should own these uh if you don't you are a criminal and I, i'm judging you i i'm actually a criminal i won't judge you so harshly i'm with you yeah but we're Sorry. gonna be we're gonna be adding this to our coffee turning our our hot coffee into cold mm. coffee iced coffee Thank you, lovely assistant. Hun iced coffee. So this is this is what ice looks like when mm-hmm. it's frozen. I don't know whether you at home have the capability to make ice, uh, but we do here. Mm-hmm. Um, and on the other side, <gasps> what? Oh, look at all those Hans. What? Oh my God! That's Han Solo and Carbonite. Not so Solo Hans. He's not in Carbonite. He's in it's, he's in Frozenite. It's Han Group. Yeah. So what we're gonna do? We're gonna pop. We're gonna pop one of these out. Mm-hmm. Okay. We're gonna try to pop one out. We just froze these like right before we shot, so, so they're probably not entirely. Now, when you froze yet. these, did you did you pour hot water in there or cold water? Um. Oh wow, that looks kind of cool. That is pretty. Yeah, neat. yeah. It's like Let's show you guys at home. Uh, so there is Han Solo, frozen in ice. Person on person off camera, can you see it? You can't see it at all. Oh yeah, let's do another one. There we go. Okay, here we go. Han Solo, frozen in carbonite or ice. Mm. If this shot doesn't work, I'm just going to cut to an extra shot later on of what it looks like. Mm. But it, does it look good? No, it, it looks terrible. I'm being told it looks absolutely appalling. It, it probably looks like a little white block. In fact, that's all it is. <laughs> that's basically all it is. So so this is what it, it, it doesn't, you can't see it at home. No, you the, can't see it. The and detail, that's a shame. Though. The detail is actually quite good. Like, you can see his belt yeah. and his face and, like, his little hands. Mm-hmm. Um, quite good. I'll, I'll get a I'll get a close-up shot for you all at home, and you can see. Frozen and Carbonite. We got this at five below um, for five bucks. Mm. Check it out. This is awesome. Like, f- why would you make regular boring ice cubes when you can make Han Frozen and Carbonite? Yeah, it makes your iced coffee taste better. These are healthy for you? Mm-hmm. Um, they're they're calorie free. Yeah. So I'm told, uh-huh. and unless you put alcohol or or <laughs> Kool Aid or something in there, right? But, um, you know, but you can use these for anything. I mean, you mm-hmm. could you could make little like molds. You could put some epoxy in here and make mm-hmm. like little Han and Carbonite molds. You can do anything. Ooh, Sky is the could, limit with these. I wonder if you could put like cake batter in there. Oh, that's a good idea. That would be pretty. Uh, well, little, little mini cakes. Yeah. I wonder how the detail would transfer. Although, how would you how would you cook this? Right. Yeah. It's all. It's all what like kind of, is that rubber? Or? It's like a rubber. Yeah. Yeah. Um, yeah. I'm sure gonna somebody's going to correct us in the comment section. Someone will probably correct us. Like, oh, and if <laughs> you, you guys, <laughs> how could you not know? Do you research? <laughs> we never do research on this show because research is not cool. Yeah. I mean, we'll look it up later. We yeah, we will look it up now, later. But... We'll do research later on. Yeah. And then I'll be like, damn it, why didn't I do research before I shot this? <laughs> we'll do a follow up episode. What the hell is wrong with me? <laughs> But the main event of today's episode is Star Wars Micro Machines. My god, Micro Machines are like a thing now again. Again? I fucking love Micro Machines. I grew up with Micro Machines, I haven't seen Micro Machines since I was 14 years old, maybe. Wow. I haven't seen Micro Machines since I was like in sixth grade. 
Um, I'm actually these are... only 16. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not. I, I forgot about that. You know, no, he's yeah. actually has Benjamin Button disease. He's like 105. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I don't um, so, so Star Wars micro machines, they're blind boxes, so I have no idea what's in them, though I'm going to uh, guess it's like a TIE Fighter, because it looks like TIE it, I, You know, I don't know what a TIE Fighter feels like, because I've never touched one before, um, but if I had to guess, it it's a TIE Fighter. What, no? Hold it on. might be something else. There was about six. I'll put up a picture right here. So I'll put up a picture so you can see like what all of them are, um, and then we'll come back to us like right now. And what we're going to do is we're going to open these these things. Mm-hmm. These I want to see if there's any. Are there any? Because I have a little hole. I have a hole. There's a hole there. But that because uh. a lot of these have like little uh, little bumper codes on them that let you know what they are. But I'm not really seeing anything here in the comments. You can post and we'll. I don't know, I'll like your comment or something, whatever. Mm-hmm. So we're going to open these, and then we're going to, you know, talk about them. So you ready? I'm ready. Ready? Are you? All right. Yeah. Three, two, one. Oh, my God. I, oh, it's so exciting. Oh, I just got another bag. Oh. It's a thing from a, one of the movies. Oh, <gasps> that's yeah. badass. You that, got the first order. That's from the first order in the new movie. Oh, cool. This I have, I, uh, I don't really know what this is from. That, uh... I'm kind of sad that I got this one and not like one of the cool ones. <laughs> yeah. This is all right though. It's pretty cool. So this is this is what it is. Um you could probably put this in the freezer and freeze it and maybe put it in the uh you know, maybe put it in your uh in your coffee. Um it's not going to do anything, but I don't know whether those those showed up. We'll get some close-up shots of these mm-hmm. and uh, we'll we'll put them in so you can take a look. Um the detailing is actually like really good. Yeah. Um, absolutely. The the paint's a little meh. It, it very much Looks a little on the cheap side, but that I mean, it, these were like two ninety nine. So for two ninety nine, that's damn good looking. Here, you take yeah. a look at this one. I'll take a look at that one. See, this is exactly if yeah, I were a nice kid, looking. This is exactly what I would expect from Micro Machines. Yeah, uh, a Star Wars themed Micro Machine. Yeah, I mean that's neat. Um, you can just sort of like throw that right on the edge of your coffee, like that, and just be like, boom. He can. I mine might fall. Oh my god, oh. my coffee is so cold from the Han frozen in carbonite ice cubes. Is it? Holy shit! Mine got warmer. It didn't. I'm, ki- I'm kidding. It's it's. That's it's weird. I cold. dropped the micro machine. I don't know where it went. Did it go in your coffee? No, uh, it didn't go in my coffee. That would have been comically hilarious. <laughs> Instead, it just disappeared. So now I'm gonna be fumbling. Who cares? So, so this is the first order. I'm really excited about the Force Awakens. Mm-hmm. Um, you know, I Star Wars Episode One was like the the event of my life when I was a kid. So I was a huge Star Wars fan, huge movie fan, and like that was like. The you know that was the those were the first ones I could see fresh in a theater and having never seen them before, mm-hmm. um, and then I saw it and I was like, that wasn't as good as I expected. It to be. <laughs> um, <laughs> and I mean maybe that's like twenty years of hype building up, <laughs> but it definitely underwhelmed. Mm-hmm. Um, I'm really hoping uh, Force Awakens uh, fixes that problem, and and what I'm seeing thus far is pretty sweet. Yeah, um, I really love the redesign of the of this. I don't know which way it's supposed to go, so we're just gonna say it goes that way. Yeah. But um, I'm so happy to see these uh, as micro machines. Um, definitely, if you are a fan of micro machines, you are a fan of Star Wars. Definitely, don't buy these. <laughs> um, I mean, buy them. Actually, these are fantastic. I yeah, I, I I'm I dig them. I yeah. kind of wish there was like a list of. I wish there was a list on the package that like showed you like this is what else you can get, um, or just tell us what what the. Uh, Let's the just ships say here. Are. It says, "Fantasy scene" mm-hmm. on here. Uh, what? That's what mine said. Why does it say "fantasy scene"? Well, I mean, this isn't happening in reality as we know it. This is this um, is fantasy. Yeah. So is <laughs> is this fantasy? You know, is. Is it? I don't. Some scientists might say it is. I mean, yeah, we could get into it. There's a few scientists who think we're living in a computer simulation. Oh yeah. So this right here, bullshit. Everything's everything's a lie. Everything you see is a lie. Why are we doing this show? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. I'm gonna go question everything. Oh my god. Yeah. <laughs> I've already done that. It's cool. Everything's fine. Each sold separately. Um, so be sure to check these out. Uh, yeah. There's there's quite. I think there's twelve of them in the blind box set. So. Uh, there's a lot to own and a lot to collect and a lot to waste your money on. So, so do you know if there's a... Star Wars ice cubes, micro machines, they're badass. Mm-hmm. Oh, absolutely. Um, now, do you know if there's like larger scale micro machines or would that like breach 
Uh, I think what the, I think there are some micro machine like sets that because I did see some like I went to Kmart and I you know because Kmart's the place to be mm -hmm. and uh, went to Kmart <laughs> checked it out <laughs> and uh, they actually did have some like larger sets um, and then Hot Wheels is actually making die cast uh, oh, cool. versions they look phenomenal yeah um, there's also like this titanium series that Star Wars put out for the Force Awakens I, I didn't like the titanium series as much as I think the die cast they're really well painted yeah they're 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 just a fan they're just fantastic Dig it. so I be sure to check it. these out yeah. yeah yeah you'll have to check them out maybe i'll put a picture up here so you all can see the uh the hot wheels die cast mm -hmm. um uh, i actually bought one of my friends one for his birthday and it, it's just a uh they're just neat mm -hmm. so mm -hmm. probably my favorite thing thus far of the star wars toys we're going to be covering more star wars toys as time goes on cool um so oh man okay so just uh i'm going back on micro machines a little bit though because yeah um yeah there there were i had a set like it was a, a minivan that you could like yeah. open up and there was um it was just like a little cityscape or whatever like um but it came with uh uh like an ambulance that you could like press on and it would just like start blinking and make yeah. little noises yeah so I, I had that one yeah it was awesome like it, it added one. so much life to it is there um, a cat behind us Pardon? You were all laughing. Our, our crew was laughing because oh. there was a cat behind us. <laughs> there was a distracting cat behind us, not I'm, a micro machine. I'm lost in the micro machine universe right now. <laughs> oh, the micro machine universe is fantastic. The guy, remember the guy uh -huh. who just like talk really, 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 like he was just like micro machine, blah, 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 blah. Oh, and he's just yeah. like, holy crap, that guy's amazing. <laughs> it's it's what he would talk like if he were the size of a micro I want I want I want an audio book from that guy. Mm -hmm. Like, I just want like, like, like the Bible written. <laughs> Yeah, that would be awesome. <laughs> Read by that guy. <laughs> like Leviticus. <laughs> <laughs> um, so, but, yeah. What, but what I was getting to, though, yeah. uh, I, I kind of hope that they uh, sort of incorporate, like, those sort of sound effects. And if they don't, I mean, not, not a big deal. But, like, I, if there was, like, still, like, those little blinky lights. This first wave, uh, you know, I think it's pretty basic. But I, I have okay. a feeling the first, this is, like, first of, like, literally dozens of waves we're oh, going to get yeah. from Star Wars. It would be so there are going to be weren't. so many Star Wars toys. Mm -hmm. It's ridiculous. It was actually really sad because I went, uh, Force Awakens, you know, the, all the toys, uh, the first line of toys came out uh, on Force Friday. Mm. Uh, and I actually went to to Walmart and Kmart and a couple other stores. Uh, some of them at midnight I went to, okay. and uh, uh, it was it was a little sad because it? it was mostly like just like forty something guys, like single guys, just walking around and like yeah. buying their Star Wars collectors toys. And like some of them, I was really disappointed. I was like immediately disappointed in a lot of the toys because they weren't really well painted. And uh. um, uh, there are a few good lines out there. Um, and maybe I'll put up some pictures of some um, either, you know, in this empty space or in the voids down here. I don't know. I'll put them. I'll put pictures up. You'll get to see. Mm -hmm. um, there are some good ones that I recommend. Uh, maybe we'll be covering some more in the future. We'll see. Um, but yeah, Star Wars Micro Machines. Pretty badass. Uh, you know, I definitely recommend. So mm -hmm. that's to, that's today's episode of Whatnots. Uh, feel free to subscribe. Follow us on Twitter. My, I am RL Schaefer Writes. You are? Todd Jacob Bison. Boom. We'll put those down at the bottom. Yeah? Cheers. Take care. Have a good one. Mm. It is so impossibly cold! <laughs> I'm blown away! <laughs> it's, it's chilly. It's... <laughs>